almost everything in our home centered around electricity, and you won't believe some of the things electricians are finding in our homes. This morning, we welcome Rusty Wise and Scotty Hutchins with Mr. Sparky. Good morning to both of you. Thanks hello, for being here Hello, hello. Good morning. Again. Rusty, let's talk about what you guys do. You're a full-service electric company. What do you offer your clients? Uh, we've been in business over 30 years, and we offer service and repair in homes and business. And uh, we, we basically tailor to the consumer for lighting, receptacles, uh, electrical, and even generators. You know, you, we started this segment by saying you won't believe some of the things we find in some people's homes. So what are some of the stories, as you unpack this, what are some of the things that we find in people's homes? What's the first thing you find? Oh, well, I've got one story. I don't know. I, I'll tell it. Where a guy was getting shocked when he washed his car. So, shocked uh, when he's washing yeah, his car? Yeah, he, he said, I get a tingle when I wash my car. So we went out and checked it. He had voltage on his plumbing. And, uh, and the wife said, oh, I'm getting shocked also when I wash the dishes. So we co come to find out they had had a hot water heater changed and the installer got the wires backwards. So he energized the plumbing system and uh, it wasn't bonded correctly. So we, we probably saved a life there. So w that's the sort of things that we, we find, you know. And I was told you found an electric panel in a shower too, is that? Yeah, oh yeah, 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 <laughs> Scotty uh, here. Electric okay. panel? Well, Scotty, he's on the front lines, and he can talk. Uh, he took most of these pictures, and yeah, yeah, that's... Yeah, so the panel's right above the shower, so if you need to trip the breaker while you're taking a shower, I guess you can. <laughs> Not a smart idea, though. No, no. Oh, my gosh, that's crazy. But, yeah, but Scotty, here, let's go stay with this. How do you find a panel in the... And the place, I mean, don't they supposed to be like when you build a house, it's up to cold and all that stuff that you have to do that? Yeah, that's true. So we we're walking through the house looking for the electrical panel, and we had no idea, and we put a special equipment on it to find the panel. And we said, can we go in your bathroom? And he's like, sure. So we walk in the bathroom, and there's the panel. And we were like, shocked. Wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> some other things that you're finding in homes, what is this we're looking at? Um, that's something there. The guy had a friend that could run a wire, so he ran a wire. He couldn't get the panel <laughs> cover back on. That's the actual image there that the thermal gun, um, gun found that was burnt. Um, that there is somebody's meter at their house. Um, our sticker barely stayed on that. A, a meter at your house is supposed to be clear. Oh, yeah, it's not supposed to be it's burnt, not supposed up. To be burnt no. up like that. That's actually there. That's a uh, cell phone charger that had caught on fire in that um, wall. That there is somebody bought a new house, and that was in the floor joist, arcing out against the floor joist. Oh, my God. That there is uh, somebody was using a space heater in a bathroom outlet. You're not it, supposed to do that. No, not at all. Not at all. It's way too hot. Yeah, it burned it up. So, and that my thermal scan uh, showed problems on that there. That's actual loose connection. Yeah. So we see those things on the daily. Mm. See, what, what I'm really uh, amazed at, people won't know all the hazards in the house unless they get a service check or things like this. So what do you do when you come to someone's house? What are some of the things that you do? Well, when we go to a home, we make sure it's safe. So we ask where the panel is, and we check the smoke detectors. And we also have thermal image scan gun, and, mm -hmm. and Scotty brought one here yeah. to show. And uh, we want to make sure that the home is safe. But see, we're the last industry in the home. We're in the home every seven to ten years. So when we would get called, it's usually something major. Mm -hmm. And, you know, people get their heat and air done maybe once or twice right. a year. But when they call us, it's usually smoking, burning, or on fire. When, some, when there's a really big problem. Yeah, yeah. and, and people, you know, the, your largest appliance in your home is your electrical system. Mm -hmm. it, it surrounds your whole home. So, I'm sorry, but Scotty, what is that thing, and what does that actually do? What is it going to do for me? This is the thermal scan gun. This is some, what I found some of those pictures with by using this. It actually lets me check for hot spots. So if you say if the lights are flickering, I'll check the panel. I'll actually check the panel cover before I touch it because sometimes they get hot and, and they can burn you when you touch them if they're, something's happening mm -hmm. inside of there. We check the outlets. I can go in your attic, no lights on at all, and Nothing. I can check and see if there's some melting wires or see it's something heating up, yeah. crawl spaces and things like that. So that way I don't have to crawl all the way to the other side. I can scan it in the crawl space and I can see if there's something over there. It's great, yeah. right? It's very helpful because oh, we, don't, we don't know, again, until something goes wrong. Um, you find problems with water heaters, too. That's another issue, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, our techs are underneath the homes or in the attic. A lot of times we find other problems. I think uh, this picture here shows the vent was knocked loose and, and you know, carbon monoxide could get into the home. Mm -hmm. So when we're underneath the house, our techs check everything, plumbing, uh, electrical, heat and air, mm -hmm. to make sure there's no safety issues in the home. Mm -hmm. I know that you're always looking for technicians, aren't you? Good qualified technicians? Yeah, we, we are looking for technicians. Uh, we're hiring the best, you know, mm -hmm. and, and we do a thorough job and uh, we're always hiring. So if you know anyone that needs a good career as an electrician, we're hiring.
Now, you've got a special offer for viewers this morning. It's a $29 service call for any electrical work. Is that correct? That's correct. Uh, if you call and, and just say, I need something done, it's $29 to come out. We'll come out with $29. Uh, no obligation and, and we'll do, I mean actually when we come out you'll get a thorough inspection of your home that you can use for us or, or another contractor. We just want everybody to be safe. Wow. That is great. Thank you so much. Call Mr. Sparky. The number is 704-323-8006. 704-323-8006. Or visit MrSparkyCharlotte.com, MrSparkyCharlotte.com. Scotty and Rusty, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. I will